Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel. I hope you're doing well. Mm. Let's check right in, shall we? See what message Spirit would like you to have at this time. <laughs> What is it that you would like the collective to know at this time? Well, we've got here the Seven of Wands in the upright. Challenge, competition, protection, perseverance, defense, standing up for yourself. Control, uh, challenged by. Challenged by the Page of Wands. Challenged by... Hmm. Freedom. Something new. Challenged by something new. New endeavor. In the subconscious. We've got the Seven of Pentacles on the upright. Perseverance, perseverance, rewards, rewards for persevering in the recent past. We've got the five of swords. Come on, my love. There you go. So conflict, upheaval, theft, abuse. With the intention and expectation, we've got the high priestess here. So somebody wanted to steal sacred wisdom, basically, from a high priestess through conflict. In the near future, Ace of Pentacles and the Nine of Pentacles. So we've got abundance, prosperity, and again, it's the fruits of your labor, rewards. Fruits of your labor, rewards for persevering through all these challenges. Huh. Baby boy. In the lens it's being looked through. Ten of Pentacles in the upright. So there's stability. For the domestic home, there's love, financial security. In the environment, we've got the hermit shining a light on things, or somebody is... Um, Doing some introspection regarding um, a judgment reversed. Regarding a punishment, some form of destruction. There's soul searching. Hopes and fears. Three of Pentacles, teamwork, collaboration, long-term rewards, and the outcome is the sun, a rebirth, all is well, positivity, two of wands in the upright, a reconciliation, and a new love, a new contract.
Alrighty then. So we've got the Seven of Wands. You are persevering through this competition. Or somebody is persevering through competition. Mm, not a wise guy. I'm thinking that's the way that's supposed to come out. I don't like it when they fall on the ground like that. You got the Page of Wands here. So there's challenges gaining freedom and leadership. So challenge by leadership and gaining freedom perseverance again perseverance perseverance and reward not a witch he's not a wise guy or she isn't a wise guy he or she isn't a wise guy they're not a witch They've been uh, maintaining control, protecting themselves against um, competition and challenge. They've been holding their own, standing up for themselves. And um, in their subconscious, there is this Seven of Pentacles. So hard work and perseverance comes forth with reward. In the recent past, there was conflict. A lot of um, folks trying to steal stuff. Trying to steal stuff from those who are just taking care of themselves. Taking care of themselves. I'm loving on myself. I'm dressing myself nice. I'm taking time to notice the beauty in the world and in myself. I mean, so there was a lot of bullies coming forth to these people who are just taking care of themselves and their environment and stuff. And they were um, being very abusive. And their intention and expectation was to gain sacred knowledge and divine wisdom and the pathway or whatever of this um, high moral person. They wanted to steal that pathway. A thief wanted to steal the pathway of a high moral person who takes care of themselves. Yeah. Yeah. This high priest has survived and is coming in into a spiritual throne. They take care of themselves and they survived and persevered through a crop load of bullying and conflict. They survived and they're and they're see they're coming into this spiritual throne. There is an ace of pentacles here, a new financial opportunity, a new career opportunity, spiritual throne. And um, a reward for the fruits of your labor, financial stability, reward for the fruits of your labor, for persevering, for not being a wise guy, for not turning to witchcraft, for just persevering through all of these people coming at you, it, it, determined to win at all costs. You stood your own. You stood your ground. And you didn't go dark. You didn't get all nasty. You're a sovereign being. Ten of Pentacles is the lens that's being looked through here. Wealth, secure, wealth security. Wealth security, stability, perhaps a home, an attainment of a home, and an important position of teacher, perhaps. Perhaps you'll be sharing your knowledge or perhaps somebody will be teaching you. We've got the hermit here, soul searching regarding this um, destruction, this punishment. They're, they're loathing themselves. We've got optimism here. Somebody's loathing themselves and, and what? And then somebody's just having optimism. You've got this long, uh, again, uh, long-term rewards for the innocent who is optimistic. There's an innocent one here who's optimistic and somebody's loathing themselves and getting punished for what they did. 
there there's the truth is out the hermit is finding the truth about about some stuff that went on went on we got the sun here and the sun whoever this is this innocent person has been observed they've been seen and they've been being watched they didn't do anything <laughs> The Most High has eyes everywhere. And just because um, people like to like to say that he doesn't exist or whatever doesn't mean it's so. So everything's been observed. Everything has been seen. This innocent person didn't do anything except be optimistic and take care of themselves. They're going to be getting a, a position, a job, within the limelight they're on this spiritual throne they're a sovereign being their ancestry is arcana and they are peaceful So you've got somebody here who is resilient. They have, they're in a, a seven of wands. They're maintaining control, standing up for themselves. They're not a wise guy. Ah, oh, a main female who isn't a wise guy. Standing up for herself, protecting herself. There is, um, so the challenge here is gaining freedom, right? There's freedom, excitement, free spirit, information, limitless potential in this leadership position. There's a mature man here. So this main female is not a witch and they're coming, they persevered. Yeah, they're innocent. They're innocent. And they persevered through whatever this challenge was and, they, and they're and they seen as innocent. They're not a witch. Somebody tried to steal from them. They were very abusive because they wanted their house. They attacked this innocent person who was just minding their own business, taking care of themselves, drinking their water, minding their own business, making sure their life was in order. They came and threw all kinds of abuse and challenges in there and conflict into their life because they saw that this person was a high priestess coming into a spiritual throne and, and she survived. She's challenged by this mature man who wants her leadership role and her gift. She is a gift or she's receiving a gift. There is an Ace of Pentacles here, so there's an abundant new career opportunity. It's a, coming into the fruits of your labor, rewards, financial stability for this sovereign being. Ah, somebody's under adjudication regarding this courtship. Could be this mature man is under adjudication for messing around with this sovereign being's courtship. We'll clarify some more. We've got a 10 of pentacles in here. So in the lens that everybody's looking through is financial security, family, inheritance, or could be some form of inheritance, whether it be a spiritual inheritance, or it could be a blending of two families coming together. There is um, an important role of teacher here for this sovereign being. Oh, high honor. Yeah, there's a change coming. This person is seen as high honor. 
there's a change coming. This person is seen as high honor. They're gonna they're they're seen as important. They're gonna be an, a teacher or sharing their knowledge or whatever it is that um, that they've learned. A light is being shined on something. Somebody's self. Somebody's loathing themselves and being punished for something in a family room. Trying to what that they they were very optimistic about. Maybe they were optimistic about whatever they did in a family room, but now they're loathing themselves and getting punished. This. There's a, there's a team here, teamwork collaboration that's been found. Oh, you got this main male and false person here. We're going to go ahead and clarify that a little more. We're going to set those right over there and we're going to, we're just going to leave them be for now. We got the sun here. It's been observed that this innocent person didn't do anything. You got the main female and the main male. I'm thinking that this main male is right here. He could be working with a team regarding this innocent person and this false person. This innocent person is his main female. Somebody's not getting a message. You didn't do anything. You didn't send a message. You didn't write a message. You, there's... Somebody could have falsified information. Somebody could have falsified an inf um, a letter saying that you wrote it and you didn't. Somebody's in despair over this privileged lady because they're, they're facing poverty. They're concerned that their toil and labor that they did to gain this great fortune didn't get them anything except bad health. So this main female isn't a wise guy. She's been protecting herself, standing up, and and uh, standing up for herself regarding this challenge. We got unappreciated here, but it's in the reverse. So she's appreciated. She's what people appreciate her. She's not a wise guy. She's standing here. Up. She's protecting herself and standing up for herself against this challenge, against this competition. She's not a wise guy. People appreciate her. There's a mature man here who's challenging her and her leadership role. He wants her limitless potential. He's going to try to connect. He wants to he wants to have a conversation. This main female is not a witch. She's innocent and she persevered and she's coming into the rewards for her efforts, for persevering, for being diligent. New chapter. She's getting a new chapter. She's going to move on. This mature man brought conflict and upheaval to this main female who isn't a wise guy, not a witch, seen as innocent, takes care of herself, minds her own business because they wanted her house and her position on this throne. They brought conflict to her and she survived. 
they were wanting to win at all costs to get her gift. But she survived and they feel broken. They feel broken. They abused her in every way that they could possibly um, think of. And they, and they, and she survived. Oh, yeah, they're, they feel broken and they're in regret. They feel shattered about this situation. They wish that it had never happened. They came after an innocent person and did all kinds of things that this person had to survive. She was neglected. She didn't have everything that she needed to get by. They did everything they could behind the scenes to make it very difficult for her. She's a sovereign being. They were, they're under adjudication for coming against her courtship, her partnership, her divine union. Ace of Pentacles. So there's this beautiful new financial opportunity and a nine of Pentacles, fruits of your labor for financial security, rewards for persevering through these challenges. And a new soul contract. You know what, this courtship this courtship um, could be, it could be that in the near future, this soul contract for this courtship is in the courthouse. It could be made official in the courthouse. High honor. Ten of pentacles. High honor. This, there's a change. This important person is going to be sharing their knowledge with others and we have mistakes but it came out in the reverse so you know of course everybody would love to claim that they never made any mistakes but what this card also says is i wish i could right my wrongs so it could be that um this sovereign being, you know, with not resorting to witchcraft, with not resorting to be sly or wise, you know, just with just standing there, taking it and persevering through it, you know, um, was not, was seen as not making any mistakes. This person remained optimistic. Somebody's um, doing some soul searching. They're, they, they're loathing themselves for whatever happened in a family room. They're seeking forgiveness. They could have done something to somebody who's optimistic in a family room and they're loathing themselves. They could be receiving a punishment. They're asking for forgiveness. This main male is here with a team um, collaborating on behalf of this innocent person. There's a false person here too. Yeah, this main male sees this innocent person as irreplaceable. There's this false person here who's hoping for forgiveness. They did something in a family room. They were really happy about it. Ah, oh, soul tie. Look at that. You got soul contract. It's in the court. It's in the courts right now with the courtship. The courtship is in the court right now. It's a new contract, a new soul contract. And then on the outgoing, you've got the sun here, a rebirth. All is well and warm and happy. And it's a celebration. You didn't do anything. It was observed. You did not do anything. You are innocent and you're innocent twice. You've got optimism. You are, you're, you're optimistic. You're innocent here. And then where was that other innocent card? Well, it's somewhere. But you survived. And then, so you got this soul tie. So now you got a soul contract. And now you have a new soul tie. Main female, main male. He feels you're irreplaceable. He sees you as innocent. You're a sovereign being. You didn't do anything. You didn't do anything. He sees that. There may have been a lot of lies done on you. 
you're very appreciated for um for t for accepting this challenge a lot of things um were able to occur because you accepted this challenge and you were able to um defend yourself well you stood up for yourself you accepted the challenge you stood up for yourself and there's um somebody's in despair here Somebody's in despair. They're feeling like they need to escape. What was on that bottom of these? Yeah, they want reconciliation. They want reconciliation. What else do we got here? Labor. They want reconciliation with the one who's in the limelight, who's on this spiritual throne. So, main female, you are appreciated. It's seen. You're not a wise guy or gal. You, you stood your ground. You protected yourself. You um, accepted this challenge and you were able to defend yourself. You were able to stand up for yourself and hold your own. Yeah. You held your balance and you, and you weren't affected by the adversity like they had hoped you would be. You stayed in balance. You took care of yourself. You didn't, you didn't uh, stop taking care of yourself. This mature man wants to have a conversation. He wants your leadership position and your limitless potential. So it could be um, he's denied. There's a denial here. Like nobody wants to have a conversation. He wants to have a conversation with this main female and she's like, ah, no thanks. I don't want to talk to you. And he's lonely because there's, because there's a change. Like there's a change. And he wants to talk to her now. And she's like, she's not a witch. She's seen as innocent. She didn't fight back. She didn't do any reversal. She didn't send anything back. She didn't attack. She didn't, she might have prayed. She persevered through all of this competition, whatever that means. And she's moving on into a new chapter. Whatever she developed within herself is sustainable. Like whatever um, balance, you know, that she had to generate within her own mind and body and energy field during this adversity in order to maintain inner harmony really caused her to um, develop skills that are sustainable. She is able to sustainably persevere through challenge. She was able to, to do that. Somebody doesn't find this funny at all. She's, she's persevered. She's working. She's coming into her reward. She's not a witch. She's seen as innocent. And somebody, this mature man doesn't find that. He, he doesn't find that humorous at all. He's quite upset about it. He feels broken about it. He's in regret. There is a defeat. Um, a, a defeat. This was a winning at all costs. This is a theft. They wanted to steal and, and win at all costs. They threw everything that they knew at this person. And this is over. They wanted to cause a death. 
They literally wanted her out of the way. They did everything they could to, to destroy her, but she survived. All because they wanted her house and her position of authority. Abundance. They wanted her abundance. They neglected her in a big way. Because they wanted her gift. And now they're in fear. They don't have any self-esteem. They're feeling pretty crappy about themselves. In the near future, this sovereign being has a new soul contract. It'll be in the court soon. It'll be made official, coming into um, the fruits of her labor, a, a life of comfort, rewards, a financial stability, and a new career, a new career opportunity. This is freedom. Happiness. So th this person isn't isn't all caught up in pride. And there's friends here. There's friends and there's acceptance. This person has seen, this person is, is seen as a um, sovereign being, as a sovereign being, a high honor, love interest. And this person, this main male is getting a soul contract with this main female. It's here in the near future. Near future. There weren't any mistakes made in this perseverance. There wasn't any backlash. There wasn't any retaliation. There wasn't any anger or vindictiveness. No, this person stood there resiliently and continued to take care of themselves, continued to hold balance. And this adversity wasn't able to take them out. Yeah. It wasn't able to take them out. And, and um, somebody doesn't have, they're, they're not feeling um, gratitude about this. They're not feeling any gratitude. And they're, they're not grateful about it. And they don't find it humorous either. They're just, they don't have anything to be thankful for right now. The light is being shined on what somebody did to an optimistic person in a family room. There's, they're loathing themselves. There's a punishment happening. They're asking for forgiveness. They're in regret. There's a main male here working with a team on behalf of the innocent. He finds his main female irreplaceable. Yeah, this false person is in regret, asking for forgiveness. Oh. They're under judgment. This main male is disciplined. And courageous. Using, um, even in times of indecision, they're very connected to their intuition and are guided by it. There is this sunny energy here. <clears throat> a rebirth, a new soul tie. You didn't do anything. It was observed. You, you are seen as innocent two times innocent you didn't send a message you didn't write a message that what if there was a message or a letter sent it wasn't you it, um yeah and you got your health you got your health there these people they want to escape they're in doubt they're in despair they have to surrender their need to control. 
They're envious because you persevered. They're envious of your ability to persevere through everything they threw at you. They, yeah, well, you weren't supposed to. You weren't supposed to persevere. They're blaming you. And your purpose. <laughs> and, you're, and now they need you to forgive them because you stepped into your purpose. See, they didn't want to have to come to you and ask for forgiveness. But now they're really messed up. The stuff didn't stuff isn't going well and you're this sovereign being on this spiritual throne and now they have to come and they have to ask for forgiveness they're mad that you came into your purpose and that you use your mind to create love and you see love in all things they're in grief and they're guilty Main female is very much appreciated. She held her balance and the adversity wasn't able to affect her in a bad way. She's not a wise guy or a wise gal. She was able to protect herself and persevere. Um, of course, protection is a proper defense. And I'm inclined to say that this protection that allowed her to persevere came from, you know, <laughs> something greater than herself. Many somethings greater than herself. They weren't able to put her in a nightmare. <clears throat> excuse me this mature man has been denied he's facing loneliness about this change he wants to have a conversation he wanted your leadership role and your limitless potential but there is no more third wheel on um, party situations <clears throat> and he didn't get the adventure it could be that whoever his third party situation was left him. <clears throat> or maybe he wants to have a conversation and say, look, I'm not doing that anymore. But be, it's only because they don't find this funny that this isn't fun for them. They're not they're they're not they're not having gratitude for this um, right here. You're ha you're entering a new chapter. You're not you're not a witch. You're innocent. You persevered through extreme challenges. You're coming into your rewards. You persevered through extreme challenges affecting your mind, perhaps. These, whoever this mature man is feeling broken and shattered. They're in regret. They wish it had never happened. They're defeated. They wanted to win at all costs. They were stopped. They have to stop. They came after this um, this innocent person who just minds their own business and takes care of themselves. And because they wanted their ability to manifest, they wanted their house and they wanted their position. They wanted their spiritual throne. They're in fear now. They're in fear. Their self-esteem is, is damaged. This high priestess survived and is, is taking this spiritual throne. She is the gift or has a gift, this um, sacred wisdom, and this, yeah, again, it's reward. 
a reward for persevering through extreme challenge, a, a reward for doing the hard work. Gaining a new soul contract in the near future, it will be in the courts. This courtship is going to be in the courts, making this soul contract official. There is an ace of pentacles here, a new career opportunity. There is a nine of pentacles coming into the fruits of your labors, stability, rewards. You're a sovereign being. You've got friends. You've been accepted by these by this friend group. You're seen as you're not prideful. You're not prideful and this this main male and this these friends um have accepted you yeah and this is the conclusion you gain you gain and and there these folks want to apologize <clears throat> your high honor there's a change here they weren't able to end you or unalive you or stop your forward momentum you've got this um ten of pentacles here so there's wealth security and a domestic home a uh, perhaps love and stability there you um didn't make any mistakes you didn't get vindictive you didn't get vengeful you didn't go dark you remained innocent And high honor. You're seen as high honor. You respect yourself. And you're coming into some real estate, a union, a mega project, a teaching position. A light is being shined on what this false person did in the family room to somebody who's optimistic, or maybe they they maybe they were very optimistic about whatever it did they did in the family room, and they're regretting it now. They're asking for 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 forgiveness. They're loathing themselves. There's punishment here. They didn't get the life of extravagance that they thought they were going to get. This main male is working with the team very disciplined, very courageously. He sees this main female as irreplaceable and innocent. Even if they're in times of indecision, he relies on his intuition and he's um, very connected. This false person is under judgment. Or he's casting judgment on this situation, on those who um, indulged and partied. On somebody else's gain on somebody else's gift on somebody else's efforts so yeah so there was no message this person this main female she didn't do anything it's been observed she's innocent there she's got and she's got this new soul tie out here in the um, and her health and it's a celebration she didn't write the letter she didn't write the message she didn't um she didn't there was no documentation to prove that she coached anybody to do anything or that she was on the dark religious path there was just no information that showed that They weren't able to curse the union. They weren't able to curse the woman or the man. Perseverance again. Perseverance. Perseverance. Mercy. There's evidence of what these people did against this family. They're protesting it. They were dominating the people Manipulating their movements, their actions, their minds, perhaps. Keeping them in an illusion. 
keeping them in a state of conflict. But through loneliness, it's like um, peace was found. Like, like when you're lonely, it's like sometimes it takes a while to get comfortable being with yourself. When you're accustomed to being around people, I've done it a, a, twice in my life that I really um, took notice of it. When you spend many years living with somebody and then all of a sudden you're living by yourself again and you have no friends because your friends group changes or whatever and you are by yourself and it takes like six months to get accustomed to being with self. It's very uncomfortable. But once you become comfortable with self, man, it's the best thing. So yeah, man, in your mind, it could be your manifestation. You might even be thinking about this promise. You might be thinking about it. Justice is being served. Justice is being served and People are stressed out. These mask wearers are stressed out because they're being rejected. They fell into a trap, into their own trap. And with that, I'm going to go ahead and leave this one. I'll see you on the next one, everybody. Bye.